low key weekend or are we here for the weekend? Both. Hey y'all and welcome back to the channel. We're Michael and Abby and last time we were living the fixer upper life in Waco, Texas. But this time we're taking on Austin. We only had a half a day, but buckle up because we hit some pretty cool spots. We're talking murals, the state capitol, and maybe even some breakfast tacos. So hit that subscribe button and get ready for a tour of one of the coolest cities in Texas. We are starting our morning at Houndstooth. I think they have incredible cold brew. The breakfast tacos, yeah, the breakfast tacos are a thing here, I found out. They are super good. I went back for a second one. And the hot sauce is so good. The hot sauce actually reminds me kind of of, of Alfred's. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's what, yeah. Abby don't like the coffee. She thinks it's kind of dirty. Um, it's okay. I mean, it's just black coffee though. Black so. coffee is black coffee, so mm -hmm. very rare. I think Dutch Brothers is like the only one that I've like genuinely like. But yeah, we're gonna go back to our hotel, check out, and then we have to leave at like three o'clock, so we have like just a few hours to yeah. kind of see stuff. So, so we are gonna go to South Congress, Sixth Street, and just I don't know really what, what but that's where we're heading right now. Where were we last night? Oh, yeah, by Felicia. There was like everyone lined up to get a picture. There's some serious Tatianas in there. I mean, they were thought in. I never actually saw a thought photo go down like that. Um, went into it about oh geez I don't know 30 pictures taken two different people took it it was uh, pretty incredible we're gonna head back to the Archer Hotel where we've been staying the Archer is a super nice hotel it's I mean it's right in the middle of all this stuff right here Ooh, Velvet Taco yeah. unfortunately we only had it three times <laughs> I could have it honestly I could have it again for lunch I wanted to try every taco that was why but Yep, heading back to the hotel right now. All right, all right, all right. We're gonna go get the car right now. Up in the parking garage, we bring it down and get our bags. Huckleberry wants that in his room. So I will say that our stay at the Archer, this hotel is super nice. Um, it is in the heart of the domain, so really everything's right here. Yeah. And it's dog friendly, so if you got a dog and you want to bring them. I'm not kidding. Like, like restaurants, coffee shops, yeah. bars, shop shops, like everything. There's dogs everywhere. Yes, yeah, so if you want to bring your hound, feel free. Uh, if you want to stay at the Archer, feel free. We're not stopping you. Mm, it's true, yeah, we're not stopping you. They even got Black Beauty right here, oh, which yeah, is a yeah. local gem, and then one of my favorites, the Little Prince. That was seriously one of your favorites? No, that's what it says. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, but the cutest thing is, they have like little like, little bedtime. Um, the adorable thing is, they have bedtime stories. <laughs> that is hard <laughs> to stop saying little. Yeah. We are heading to else other other places. Okay, see ya. Totals. Motherfucker. Don't say that. We made it to downtown Austin. Uh, right now we're on South Congress. Um, there's just a lot of like shops and then murals. So we're gonna go to Aviator Nation first. <laughs> and then I don't really know what else. But that was the first stop we we're gonna do at least. Congress. This is pretty um, much like all shopping uh, and food, but it's really neat. A lot of like, you know, nice stores, trending stores. That I love you so much uh, mural is on the wall. 
So that's on the street. And we're looking for like another mural, for like an Austin one, but it's on like South First Street. So we're gonna go try to find that now. Totally forgot to vlog where we were there, but that Austin sign. Yeah. Where they, is it? Uh, 720 South First Street. Yeah, but very, very cute. Yeah, there's actually it, two there. Yeah, there's two murals there. There's also a uh, like a neon sign. I don't know if it's like a museum or whatever. Like it's, a neon sign shop. Yeah. Um, that that mural though, that 720 South First Street. Make sure you have a tripod or something. Yeah, it was. Or somebody to take the picture because yeah. there's nothing. No, there wasn't. There wasn't many people over there. But it's also a 10 minute walk. It's a half a mile, 10 minute walk from South Congress Street. So True. we were going to drive there, then we were just afraid that there wouldn't be parking. Parking. So we but just there was. Walked. Uh, kinda. Not right. Kinda, yeah. If you put, went to like a restaurant there, maybe. Yeah. We are at the Texas State Capitol building. And one of the cool things, like on the grounds, there's so many like statues and memorials. Like, like they even have a cowboy, which I'm assuming is uh, John Marston or Arthur Morgan from Red Dead. Of course. But of course. And we saw a celebrity. Um, we saw Sandy Cheeks. Sandy Cheeks from SpongeBob. Wish I was back in Texas. She was too busy to sign autographs. She's visiting family. Understand. She said Dirty Dan just left. <laughs> Remember that one? <laughs> Which one of you failures is Dirty Dan? So we're just gonna walk around here a little bit, just see some of these statues, memorials, and then go get lunch. Um, oh, maybe a maybe go to a park and get like a drone shot. I don't want to fly my drone right oh, here. Oh yeah, like the kind of <clears throat> the city. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, we're just gonna just walk around here and look at. Oh, parking's free on Sunday. Well, we hope, anyways. <laughs> so we'll let you know. If we get back, fine. Our car is still over there. Low key weekend, or are we here for the weekend? Both. We found Sandy, her cousin. Sam Cheeks. Sam Cheeks. All right, so we are at Freebird right now. Um, we have never had this. It's rated number one burrito in Texas. It's kind of like a Chipotle. These chips and queso, the weirdest thing, when you like first try it, and like that first initial taste, it tastes like Fruit Loop, like milk. It actually kind of does. Dude, this is the worst video ever, unwrapping a burrito. Jesus, it looks like <laughs> signs when they put the things over their head. This is a cayenne tortilla shell, so we shall see how good this is. Try it. Okay. There's some heat to it, I don't know. That's from the habanero sauce or what? It's good. So we almost forgot. Um, here's the cupcakes from yesterday, but I've not opened them. They've been in a hot car, so I don't know if they've like kept their shape or if they've like melted. No, 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 wow. But yeah, they they look exactly the same. <laughs> okay. Makes you wonder just what are they putting in the cupcakes down there in Waco? What exactly are they putting in the water? down at Jackson's Bayou, Louisiana. Feels like a water boy announcer. All right, you wanna try? Sure, go ahead. I'll do the strawberry one. That's what I want. Oh, that looks good. Yeah. These are heavy. I could chuck a shot put. Those are delicious. Those are very good. This one was the lemon lavender. Lemon lavender. If you like lemon, this is very good. Oh, that is very good. Did make it to the Yeti flagship store. We're here right now. Um, they got a bar, but you can sit. Everything is you sit on Yeti coolers. Stage. They got a stage, a bar. There's a golden retriever laying out on the bar. <laughs> yeah, but um, yeah, we made it. I don't even know, a blonde? It said it's local, so I'm not sure. How did they put it in our Yeti? I know, it's all in the look. Oh yeah, and see? Oh yeah. 
Yeah, all the sheet, all the sheets, all the seats are Yeti coolers. And then look at this is uh, Yeti loaner right here. Oh, cool! Awesome. Well, we did make it to the Yeti flagship. Um, we're just sitting here, and this is the last thing we are doing before our flight. And I. So it's all wrapped up. Uh, have you got a cute mug? Yeah. Oh, I'm wrapped. Right. I got a new cup because I always think if I get a new cup, that's gonna make me drink my water. Oh yeah. <laughs> so we'll see if this one actually does. Yep. But uh, yeah, that'll do it for this trip in Austin. Overall, it's been a really good trip. It's been kind of unplanned. It's been very Fast. rushed, very rushed, and yeah. But I uh, really did enjoy it. Very cool city, um, cool area. Um, yeah, we were heading home. We got a flight in here in a couple hours. Got to head back to the airport. But if you like the video, be sure to hit that like and hit that thumbs up and hit that subscribe if you haven't already. And we'll see you next time. Uh, yep, toodaloo. We are at the Velvet Taco uh, for lunch, and I was coming here regardless. And Abby just happened to be have a little break for her to come down and join me for tacos because I we know. can't we, we can't pass up tacos. But yeah, I got the uh, uh, picnic and a chicken and waffle. And Abby got a chicken and waffle, so we will uh, see how that is. It looks really good when they're coming out, and the presentation it's like Instagram worthy. So. Oh my gosh, that looks looking good. Yeah, look at these. Grab, grab the ticket. Oh, this is like floppy like a waffle. Oh my word. I'll try the picnic. I, I wouldn't have time for hot sauce today, so I won't get any. I'll just taste it for what it is. All right, that took a little bit longer than expected, but holy crap, that was super good. It was super fast. It wasn't bad at all. What? The bad? No, 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 the wait time wasn't oh. bad at all. It wait was wasn't quick. bad, food was really good. So that was Velvet Taco. Maybe end up getting it again, I don't know, we'll see. I would. I would too, there's like a, it's kind of like a Gava Van Rye with all the different options, like specialty type tacos, but that uh, gravy on that chicken and waffle was so good. All right, we got our second morning of houndstooth coffee, and this time, so I, I, I guess the Uber driver and everyone last night kind of said that breakfast tacos are a big thing here, and it seems like everybody has them. The only but, breakfast taco that I've really had is McDonald's. That's a burrito, that's a breakfast burrito. Oh, so these are breakfast taco. tacos, yeah. Okay. Yeah, so I got a breakfast taco at houndstooth along with my cold brew that I got yesterday. Um, we're gonna have more time Sunday morning, so we're gonna, do a little more in-depth review, but I wanted to like get a little test to make sure that this is it. So yeah, I'm gonna go back and edit today and maybe walk around here and do some more browsing. And then, yeah, I don't really, oh, and coming back to Velvet Taco again for lunch because we're creatures of habit. All right, so we are back at Velvet Taco for lunch, which I knew we would be. This time we're trying more tacos. We got two uh, picnics again. I got a Cuban pig and then, what is that? Rotisserie? Rotisserie, yeah. So yeah, and then we got the queso, which was amazing. And then, seems to be the fan paper around here. The drink of the trip. Yeah, and it's really good. Good? I'm gonna try the uh, pig today since I got the uh, picnic yesterday. Abby's here. I feel like I look like a corporate pet. I kind of feel like I look. I know. <laughs> She's dressed all biz cash. But uh, yeah, so we are in the domain right now. Um, that's where we've been staying. And I would just say that. Endless this, shopping? Yeah, there's a lot of, lot of shopping. A um, lot of food. Yeah, so it seems like it's split in two areas. Like one side's all restaurants, which is like where we're staying. And then this side's like all shopping. And I'll say like a lot of stores we like, like Levi's, Vans, Free People. Madewell. Lu Madewell, Lululemon, 
Gucci Louie, but you know, that's for a special occasion. But um, like the AE, sometimes you just want a good AE, you know, shirt and some Abercrombie. Any. No, or Abercrombie, no, but. Um, it's like elevated shopping. Yeah, it seems like it is. I really enjoyed this area. Uh, but yeah, it's definitely, this is skater towards like shopping and restaurants. So it's definitely, um, tomorrow we're gonna go to Waco and explore Austin like the next two days so we'll see more of it there but where we're at now I mean it's still a really good area for yeah. like the, the like a day trip or maybe even a weekend yeah so the area is pretty cool but um I couldn't resist oh I have got something free people too so it's not super cute yeah super cute. I got the 501 93 jeans so it's been I forget what he said every 26 years they bring back a new fit so that's what I got. But uh, yeah, we're getting some starbs right now and we're gonna head back to yeah. the hotel and wrap up my work thing and then yeah. we have the weekend to ourselves. Yes, so tomorrow morning getting a rental car, which was very hard to find actually. Um, getting a rental car and then going to Waco. That's the plan, at least for now. Oh, and the, we're gonna get breakfast taco in the morning. Yeah, yeah early because yeah. I want the table, uh, those French toast, like a brunch. So I wanna make sure I'm Oh, hungry. yeah, yeah. So yeah. no, we'll just get coffee in the morning then. And then Works Sunday morning we'll get breakfast tacos, Works but they were incredible. All right, well, um, that's for today, and then we shall see you in the morning. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. We'd really appreciate if you hit that like and subscribe if you haven't already. And don't forget to follow us on Instagram and TikTok. And we will see you on the next video.